I call you and need you my heart's on fire. <sighs> You're simply the best. <laughs> Hurry up. Probably we're already filming. Oh wait, <laughs> yeah. God, right, yeah. Hmm. Slightly embarrassing, we can cut that bit. No, we can't, because I've just said we can cut that bit. Okay, hmm, carry on. Hi guys! <laughs> it's Robbie James here from Mr. E Magic. So, for the last couple of days, I've been running a competition to win a free children's party package. Um, we had quite a few entries. There was around 15 right answers. The question was, where did the Wombles live? Okay. A lot of you put Wimbledon, Wimbledon Common. That's wrong, unfortunately. We were looking for Womble Wimbleland. No, <laughs> we weren't really. We were. If you put Wimbledon or Wimbledon Common, that was right. So well done. So these are the people that got it right. We'll try and do it as quick as we can. Uh, Kerry Garland. Well done, Kerry. Brilliant. So I'm going to pop you into the hat. This is my magician's hat, by the way. So I'm going to pop you in there. Um, Jeanette Ellis. Well done, Jeanette. Jeanette, the best a man can get, so I'm told. Uh, Daniel Sheridan, well done, Daniel. It's quite patronising saying well done, actually, isn't it? Because <laughs> it was a, quite an easy question. Um, Rebecca, Rebecca Marie Bedder, well done, Rebecca Marie Bedder. That's quite a mouthful. We won't be able to say that after a few glasses of wine. Um, blank piece of paper. <laughs> Thank you, Steph. You're welcome. Sack the assistant. Um, Heidi Seb Billing, well done Heidi. I don't know any of these people yet. I'm s I apologise if I do. Probably shouldn't have said that. Um, <laughs> Shawnee Brownie, I know Sean. He's a he's a friend from Cromer. Shawnee Brownie, well done. Uh, Barbara Kelly, I wish her name was Streisand. I'd sing a little song there. I'll probably. Do 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 do. That's the one. <laughs> uh, Dawn Bailey, well done Dawn Bailey. I'm going as quick as I can. I have to go quick because Steph whinges at me that her arms ache. They do. She's holding the camera. Uh, Linda Hislop. Fantastic. Well done, Linda. Linda is um, quite often popping up. She's been following Mystery Magic for quite some time now, so thanks for that, Linda. Uh, Sandy Morton. I recognise that name. Uh, Barmaid at San Of course it is. Sandy from the establishment where we used to go and participate in... A beverage. A couple of beverages. Uh, Samantha Hall. Samantha Hall's just booked a show with Mystery Magic, so if you if you win this, Samantha, then we'll make sure we get your deposit back to you, and you can have the show completely free. Uh, Andrew Davies, also known as Andy the Clown, I've worked with Andy before, fantastic guy. How you doing, Andy? Hope you're good. Um, Laura O'Halloran, another one who's just booked a show, so same applies to you, Laura. And Shirley Jones, well done, Shirley. Okay, so here's the moment of truth. Da, 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 how many was there? Did you count? 15 or 16, I think. So you didn't count, though? No. You didn't ask me to count, did you? Okay, here we go. And the winner is... Da, 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 da. Fingers crossed. <laughs> I think I've got two. No, I've got one. And the winner is... Da, Heidi Seb Billy! Well done, Heidi. Um, if you give me a message, uh, contact me, whatever, and we'll sort out getting you a kids' party sorted. I hope you have children, otherwise it's going to be a children's party for adults. <laughs> All the other guys who got it right, if you do book a Mystery Magic show, we're going to give you 30% off the price anyway. Um, so, well done, guys, and we'll run some more competitions later in the year. See you soon.